Hi friends, this is Devansh and in this video, I am going to tell you how you can fix Valorant has encountered a connection error, but I already explained a few methods in my earlier video and here in this video, I tried another method and also rectify my earlier mistakes. So if you find this video useful, please let me. So firstly run command prompt as administrator. Once you run the command prompt as administrator, you have to type this command. So this is a command given by one of our uh, viewers. So he said that he this worked. So let us try also. So I just want to spread it. Like everyone should try this method also. And just type this command and execute it. And once the operation gets successful, just exit and try to restart a system. As he suggested, this might work. So just try it and check if this method really worked so i just want to share it with you guys so this is the first method now we will go to the second method so this is the method which i have explained earlier in my video also but there i have done one mistake so i i am going to rectify this in this video so here you have to type first command as sc delete vgc which i have said in my earlier video also but the second command should be sc delete vg k which I have explained as VGLC in the last video, which is wrong. So once you execute this, just type exit and you will exit from command prompt. Then again, go and restart your system. So once your system get restarted, you have to go to the file explorer and in the file explorer, you have to go to the C drive in your C drive. You will find a folder called program files. Go into that and just go into the folder Riot Vanguard. You have to right click on it and delete this folder, which I explained earlier also. If you get this message pop over, then this this might working in your background. So exit from there, right click on it and click on exit. So we'll exit from there and now try to delete it here. So once you have deleted this folder, then again, you have to go and restart your system. So once your system get restarted, just go and try to again open the game and check that you are getting that error or not. It will again install this React Vanguard. So once this download will get completed, again try to execute the game and check you are getting the error or not. So if you are not, if this method works, please like this video and subscribe to this channel. And if you method doesn't work, then please let me know. Thanks for watching.